Hey guys, this is Roblox user, and today we'll be studying our next step in the process of making GUIs. So, we're making buttons, which are really easy, but there's only one thing, is if you click a button, it won't really do anything unless you have a script for it. And what I mean by script is a script that allows it to do something. You know, such as open up something, or make you die, or, you know, whatever you want to, however you want to customize it. Um, point is, you need a script. So, I'll show you how to make one, you know. First, you gotta open up Roblox Studio, and go in edit mode, because that's the best way to do screen GUIs. Alright, so, we'll be making a run GUI, that'll allow you to run, just as an example. Alright, so you can go to Starter GUI and highlight it. Go to Insert Object. And you're going to find Screen GUI. And you do. You're going to double click it. Click OK. Click it over here in the Explorer. So it highlights. Go to Insert Object. And find a text button. Then you're going to click OK. Click that again. After you customize the button, of course, you know, you just pick the colors however you want. So let's do that now. Size. You always do the size on the right, the right, you know, zero. That's it. Oops, a little too much. So let's see how it looks here. There we go. Now do position. So we'll go to this one. And now this this position size determines it going up and down. You know, however big the number is. So we'll go to 100 and you can see the difference right here. So we'll put it down to where a player would be able to see it. Let's go down 300. There we are. It's kind of a big button. We can reduce the size if we want. The width or whatever. Let's change that back. So let's go to 30. So there. Now it's looking like a thin button. Okay. Now we go down, and you know, you, you customize it however you want. There's many ways to customize it. As you can see, you have all these options. You know, you can customize it however you want. You can click it draggable so people can drag the GUI itself. You know, you got your font, your font size. And we'll change that just for an example. There, font's bigger. Now, we'll go to text. Just whatever. So we'll do run. Then, text color can be anything you want. This is why I love making GUIs, is they're just as customizable, customizable as you want. Sorry, I just, I sort of just woke up this morning, so I'm a little, a little sleepy. So there, you have your text button itself. Now what we need to do is click text button and add a script. Now a script I'll put in the, in the description and therefore you can copy it although for you know just to be safe I don't to save you the time of me writing the script um, myself I have copied it put another script just so you don't have to sit there and so we can go by time okay so there we have it simple script and you'll learn how to do these soon enough they're very simple if you just look at the script and try to you know try to analyze what it's talking about you can start writing these yourself and you know walk speed equals 35 so that's your walk speed when you click the GUI um, you can change it high which is 85 I'll click it to 85 so your speed will turn to 85 once you click the GUI and if it's the same thing. You can make a walk GUI. You just use the same script, and all you do is you set this below 16. So it would be, you know, 13. Because 16 is the normal limit that your Roblox in walks. So, you know, it's complete. You can make a run and a walk GUI that easy. Set back to 85. I think we're done. You know, we just close that. Whatever we need. Let's go to tools, test, and play solo. Yeah. If not familiar with the Roblox Studio, 
um, just message me for anything you need. It's fairly simple. If you don't know how to get the properties or explore bar, you know, you just, just PM me on Roblox. My name is Funker Chief. Or, you know, anything like that. So here I am in my place. You know, there's a brick. This brick is to symbolize how fast I'm going. So you see there, just normal limit. Click this. Now I'm super fast. Now, the, the video on YouTube might be a little laggy, but you can see I'm going super fast. And there you have it.